Welcome. My name is Isabou Iqbal, and I'm an educational developer at the Center for Teaching, Learning, and Technology at the University of British Columbia. This video outlines what to do if you've been contacted to conduct a formative peer review of teaching and you work in a post-secondary institution. It's for anyone who's new to doing peer reviews of teaching or anyone who might need a reminder on what to do. The first thing you'll want to do is have a conversation with the instructor who's contacted you for a review. You want to make sure that you're the right fit for one another. One of the things you'll want to find out is what's prompting the request. Is it a department head who has asked the instructor to contact you? Or is it that the request is coming from the instructor themselves? To help the reviewer and the reviewee decide if they're the right fit for one another, there's a few different things that you'll want to discuss. One is your respective approaches to teaching. You also want to find out what the reviewee's goals are for the peer review of teaching. The reviewer may want to talk about their experience as a reviewer and why they do peer reviews of teaching. I always let the reviewees know that it's a privilege to be invited into somebody's classroom. And of course, you'll want to talk about deadlines and timelines because the reviewee may have a deadline that the reviewer can or cannot meet. It's important that the reviewee know that they have a choice about who does the review. So the reviewer can let them know that they have a choice. Once you've decided that you want to go ahead, you'll want to make sure to book a few meetings. What is the pre-observation meeting, the classroom observation of teaching, and the post-observation meeting? And then as a reviewer, make sure that you book time in your calendar to review the instructor's materials, anything that they're going to send you that's relevant to the peer review of teaching. Once all that's done, you can start preparing for the pre-observation meeting. And for more on that, please check our video on the pre-observation meeting. Thank you for watching this video. Please be in touch with questions or suggestions. I'd love to hear from you.